Good morning, Bora High. This is Zach Spencer and Natalia Hines. And these are your Wednesday, February 26, 2014 announcements. Golf meeting tomorrow in room 807, a break. AP students, you are now able to sign up for your AP test in the business office. Mr. Ritchie will be distributing the registration forms this week in your AP classes. If you need financial help for the test, please return to the green sheet that was sent to your home last week at, to the Career Center. It is due this Friday, but Mr. Ritchie will still take them on Monday. Reminders to all junior and senior members of National Honor Society to attend tomorrow's night formal induction ceremony at 7 p.m. Friends and family are invited to attend. The ceremony begins at 7.30. All members should check the NHS board in room 107 to sign up for a variety of services opportunities, especially next week's elementary reading events. Now for weather with Liam. Thanks guys. Our high tomorrow will be 54 and a low of 42 with an 80% chance of rain. Back to you guys. Thanks Liam. The Lake Leader Talent Show auditions will be held March 6th and 7th in the auditorium after school. Start getting your groups together now and practicing. Judges will be looking for creative, different, upbeat acts this year. There is no need to sign up early. Judging will occur on a first come, first serve basis on March 6th and 7th after school in the auditorium. If you have questions, see Becky Woodland in the counseling office. First prize is $150. Do you have a favorite teacher and want to show your appreciation? Barnes & Nobles is holding their annual favorite teacher contest. Students must write an essay, poem, or thank you letter describing their favorite teacher and how that person has influenced and inspired them. For more information, visit the link below. All works must be turned in by next Monday. Winner and teacher will receive $5,000. Now for World News with Adam. Wait. Thanks guys. This week in the news, aspiring Marine at 17 shot dead by a female police officer who mistook Nintendo Wii controller he was holding for a gun. Police went to the 17 year old's home to serve a warrant on his father over a parole violation. When Christopher Rope opened the door, an officer shot him in the chest. Police claim he was holding a gun while witnesses say he was holding a Nintendo Wii controller. Idaho Governor C.L. Butch Otter says Idaho State University could lose its license to conduct nuclear research from the Nuclear Regulatory Commission if a bill to allow concealed weapons on college campuses becomes law. Officer says ISU President Arthur Vialis told him that the commission has a zero tolerance policy regarding weapons at licensed nuclear research facilities. The Pope will also name an auditor with oversight powers according to a Papel document known as Matu Proprio in Latin for by his own initiative, formalizing the changes. Thanks, Adam. Lions Den Monday through Thursday from 3 to 5. The teacher will be Mr. Freeman and the tutor will be Nigel Haveen. At break, orchestra will be selling bagels. At lunch, choirs holding a bake sale and rowdies will be selling pizza and slushies. Rugby is starting this week. Practices are at 4.30 Tuesday and Thursday at Frank Church. Club news, all these clubs are meeting at lunch. World leaders in room 212. Physics club in room 416. Cross campus in room 405. The Gay Straight Alliance in room 408. German club in room 207. Drama club in the Little Theater. Have a great day, Bora.